And that wasn't the most embarrassing performance by a Florida Gator on the field. It was their head coach who's supposed to be a leader that comes out there and makes all these excuses. Could have opted out. Well, coach, you should have opted out then. Because you you talk about an embarrassing performance for a coach to get up there that's a leader of a program and say, we could have opted out. That wasn't our real team. And to make the comments he did, it's embarrassing to those players. They got outplayed, whether they had their whole team or not. And Dan Mullen, I believe, is 13 and 38 against ranked opponents. So maybe look in the mirror. And and if you if you would have won this game, you know what you would have said? We came out there. We were ready to play. We were all these things. You weren't. You weren't ready to play. Your team had no answer for a very good Oklahoma team. You were outclassed no matter who you were without. But what you never want to hear from a player is excuses. I hear coaches yell that all the time when people make mistakes. I don't want to hear excuses. Just get it done. He's being paid handsomely to go out there and perform, not make excuses. But this is just another moment in time in this 2020 season when Dan Mullen has left uh, a podium or a field. And I leave scratching my head thinking, why is this guy leading a program? He doesn't seem fit to do so. And this is just another moment in time and an example of that. I'm embarrassed for Dan Mullen, not the team. I'm embarrassed that he came out and said these kind of things. It shows no leadership, shows a lack of culture, and Florida Gator fans should be embarrassed, and I'm sure administration should be embarrassed by comments like this being made.